Should I try on an ensemble? Or is that too much? <laughs> oh, I hate when lines are so long. crazy when they have those damn sales. I swear, I have no patience. Literally like 20 minutes on the line. But now, I'm about to head home, so the only way to get home when the trains don't work is to get a guy that was gonna pay for the cab. <laughs> it's bike bike, if we can find the bike that is and I don't get run over in the streets. Yes, I'm riding with these cute shoes. <laughs> Yay! Let's see. 27 minutes, time to go. All right, let's get going. I went shopping at the men's department challenge. Can I make it look better than my beer? Let's get into it, bitches. First, the primero outfit for this video is going to be this tank top that is kind of like knitted from the men's department. Of course, I got it in size medium because they didn't have a size small. This costs $45.90. And if you're experimental and you want to have fun with your fashion, don't forget you can actually shop in the men's department. And I did. I just wish it was cheaper than women, but in some ways they are. But Zara's been getting a little bit more expensive. But I got this because I love the colors and it's summery. It goes with my beautiful nails. Yes, because I have my nails done. Of course, you see that like in almost every video now. I thought the colors were beautiful, very summery, and I wanted to try this on. And so I got this with a matching pant. And the pant is like this kind of like it gives me almost like scrubs, like hospital scrubs look, but it's very baggy. This is a size small. This costs $69.90. It's reading off a little bit more ivory yellow on camera, but this is more like limey yellow. It's bordering a little bit more on the greener side, but it's still a pastel pale color. And girls, like stuff like this, I mean, if you find it cheaper. Then in the women's department, this is great. You're gonna see how it fits right now. And I think the, the combination looks beautiful. I went ahead and paired it with like some heels. I wanna bring it up. And then you're gonna see in the B-rolls that I went ahead and paired it with a different shirt, a different look, just to give you variety. But you're going to see the whole look. And let me know if it looks better than my BF because he swears. It's always a competition between me and him. I mean, he thinks he just is better than me. <laughs> So you're ready to see the outfit? In five, five, I said five. In five, four, three, two, one, hit it! Outfit in Spanish. Hey Google, translate outfit in Spanish. In Spanish, that's atuendo. Huh? Anything else you want me to translate? Yes, outfit in Spanish. Si trajes en español. Oh, that sounds better. Trajes. I don't know what the hell she said before because clearly I'm a bootleg Spanish person. Oh. Número dos is this t-shirt in olive green and i love olive green these are like my type of tones i love color but i feel like i tend to be very selective in color because year round i tend to look pale but now i hit the bottle a little bit more so i look a little bit more tan <laughs> that's just between you and i this olive green color just reminds me of my bf because his eyes are kind of this color they're a little bit lighter than green but i feel like this looks beautiful on him and when i saw it i was like uh let me try it it might look better on me <laughs> This costs $45.90. This is a size small. I know it's going to be looser, but girls look cute in looser clothing too. We don't always have to wear tight stuff. And so I wanted to try this on a casual t-shirt that I would wear all the time, every day. I could get a lot of wear and tear from this. And then I needed something to pair it up with. So I went ahead and paired it up with these other pants that are in the men's section. These are in a size medium. I didn't see a size small. This is the jogger fit type of pants. 
This one costs $39.90. It's actually cheaper and you're gonna see that these actually fit pretty good. Let's see. Do I make this look better than my BF? Because it's on like Donkey Kong. It's war, bitches! It's war because he always thinks he just is better than me. You let me know what you think and if you would actually wear it. You're gonna see the outfit. And ready? In three, two, one, hit it! This cute sweater. This is giving me Scala. Scala vibes because it's a vest. Look how cute this is. I mean, look at the pattern. It has like, it's giving me Aztec vibes. This color is so beautiful. I love the colors on it. I thought it was super fun. This is something that I would definitely rock during the fall into the winter. And there's many ways of rocking this. You can wear this with like a buttoned up shirt on there and keep it that collegiate look with like the pleated little tiny tennis skirt or schoolgirl skirt. I'm wearing it in this video, which I just think that the color patterns worked beautifully. If you're bored with your outfits, play with colors. And that's why I wore it with these track pants that I have that are by Scotch and Soda. Don't worry, everything will be linked up below. And I think the color combination looked beautiful. I went ahead and paired it with some nude sandals for now, but you can do anything with this. And this is in the men's department. This is a size medium, and this is on sale right about now for $25.99 at Zara's. And originally it's $49.90, so I think it's actually better because I feel like it should be costing $25.99 normally. Did I kill it looking like a man? As you're gonna see in the B-rolls. In three, two, one. Hit it. All right, bitches. Did I do it justice? Let me know down below which one is your favorite outfit. Did it inspire you to try? stuff out in the men's department i hope you guys have fun if you like to see more type of videos like this please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down lets me know either way comment down below it helps with the algorithm with youtube if you don't comment like my video youtube is not going to recognize me and get me out there and hit the bell the notification bell it would just let you know when i upload because then you wouldn't know when i upload and what's the point of me making videos if you're not going to watch them.